And we back. Now for the past few days, I've been kind of thinking like, wouldn't it be great if there was some website that randomly generated NBA players? And then we took those NBA players and did a rebuild. That, that website exists. See, I was looking on Twitter and just going through my mentions and Tiana, who's a fan of the channel, shout out to you, hit me up with a link to this website name, Get Random Things. And on Get Random Things, you can get random NBA players. For example, they gave me Quincy Acey, Cal Kuzma, um, Rashawn Holmes, Anthony Davis, Jonas Grepko, and Anthony Brown. Don't really know who that is. So what we're going to do, <laughs> we're going to change this number to 15. Because there's 15 players in the NBA roster. And then we will randomly generate a team. We throw that team with 2-2-K. And then we try to rebuild that team. Tiana, thank you for contributing to the channel. I'm always looking at my, my messages my DMs on IG. So hit me up with ideas if you got them, all right? Let's get to our players. And here is our team. They start us off with Kevin Love. I see Bradley Beal there. Kawhi Leonard. Oh, okay. TJ Warren. There's a couple guys that I don't know, like Mangok Mataigong. Ooh, well, I don't know if he's in 2K. If he is, he'll be on my team. If he's not, he won't be. But I cannot complain about having Bradley Beal, Kawhi Leonard, and Kevin Love. That's our own version of the big three, baby. The rest of the players are kind of eh, but I'm going to make it work. The boys are here. I really like this team, at least the very top of it. There's some players we had to bring out of retirement, like Derek Collison. Um, bring him out of retirement. I told him we was going to help him win a ring. But in reality, we'll probably trade him. Oh, I'm, I'm not a worse person. Um, they also had Jason Terry on that list, and, well, he retired. Eric Moreland is not in 2K, and that one guy whose name I could not pronounce is not in 2K either. So, what we did is we just filled it with some bombs from free agency, and uh, that's how we're rolling right now. But we do have Bradley Beal, Jeremy Lamb. We do have Kawhi, instantly a dub. So, my job is to get Kawhi another running mate, hopefully a big. I do like Kevin Love, but I'm going to trade him. I'm a trade. I need like a center. I need a good center. So Kevin Love in our first round pick, what can they bring us center wise? If I could get Click Appella or a player of that stature, I think we pulled off a oh. Hmm. I like this trade a lot too. Hold on. Uh trade number 10 is looking dope. No click appella here. But trade number 10 looks so good, I cannot pass up on. We're bringing Vucevic, who, of course, as we know, was an all-star last year. And an Alfred Camino was like one of those glue guys. So he'll hold that power forward position spot, at least for now, until we find something better. So we're looking at Darren Collison, yada, yada. Vucevic slides in perfectly. I do want to get a better <laughs> a better point guard again. Darren Collison, I'm sorry I lied to you, my guy. But, I mean, things have to be done for the ultimate goal, which is a championship. Norman Powell, I need to get him out of here. I'll go Norman Powell, Derek Hollison, and a first-round pick. I just need somebody that's an 81, 82 overall. I'm trying to think of people. Uh, give me an Eric Bledsoe type. Eric Bledsoe would be cool. Will they give me Eric Bledsoe? Nope, not an option, which makes sense. Eric Bledsoe's valuable to them. Um, Monte Morris doesn't help. Yeah, getting a starting point guard for this would be kind of difficult. So let's go the old-fashioned route. What teams are selling? Bulls are rebuilding. John Wall is on the cap. We're not taking John Wall's contract. I mean, I don't even think it's possible for us to get Kimball Walker right now, so we'll slide right past that. Trey Young is an option because they're rebuilding. Again, you throw a rebuilding team, a bunch of first-round picks, they will accept. But I feel like I've had Trey Young in a recent video, so we'll go past that. Jamal Murray is kind of intriguing. I think we may go Jamal Murray, and if we can't get Jamal Murray, we're going to go Lonzo Ball. So trading for Jamal Murray may be a bit difficult because I know he got that big extension. Oh, not Paul Millsap. No, no, no. Um, I know he did get that big extension, but it, but it doesn't kick in until next year. So making the salaries match might be a problem here. Norman Powell, they still need to make a $4 million, and they don't really have any bad contracts. So making a trade is going to be tough. Give us Will Barton. We honestly don't have that much value to give up. Uh, we'll give you a pick. Give me a count offer. No count offer. But honestly, we throw in some picks here. They may be. They may actually accept this trade. Jamal Murray's on a three-star value for him. Will Bard's only two-star value. So you throw them picks in. Deal. Simple. Um, so we're looking at Jamal Murray, Bradley Beal, Kawhi, Alfred Camino, and Vucevic. 
off the bench we have a, a decent amount of scoring i need a better backup center so i will trade <laughs> Derek hollis i'm sorry my guy but you know things have to be done but there may be a world where he stays on the team if he can't get me a good backup center right here he will stay on my team zach hollis is good i did see neurons noel i do like neurons noel oh but i really like ed davis ed davis is the trade Ed Davis is right. Ed Davis is like one of those big men that I just really enjoy. So there's that. Uh, we're going to shorten this rotation for now. Let's make it a nine-man rotation. How does this team not win a championship? You tell me. I mean, there's a world, right? There's a world where we do this. We make Vucevic a power forward. And then we go out there to really hit that five-player lineup. Because right now, Alfred Gamino is our starting power forward, which is cool and all. But if we could get we could get better. We don't need Will Barton and TJ Warren. One of these guys has to get dealt. And we could potentially, and I say potentially, get something great. Two first round picks with Will Barton. I need a starting center. 80 overall or higher. A healthy boogie is here. But can I do this without giving y'all two firsts? They want that second first round pick. How about instead of that second first round pick, I give you another second. They still want that second, that first round pick. How about I give you another second? All right, they're just not interested. We'll do the original deal. You want that second first round pick? Sure. Solid Andrew, Real Barton are gone. We're we getting Boogie to be our starting center. I know this is not prime Boogie Cousins, but I do like Boogie. He's in D.C. now. Um, there's rumors that he will go to D.C. to team up with John Wall, but John Wall is not in our team anymore. This is a three all-star one borderline, or one guy who has all-star potential and one past all-star lining up. And off our bench, we're looking good. We got some defense. I would like to get a better backup point guard. We may be able to actually just sign a guy. Jeremy Lin. Let's get Jeremy Lin another ring. Hold on, hold on. We got to get Jeremy Lin another ring. We'll release Kobe Simmons or Simon Simmons. Simmons. And we'll bring in Jeremy Lin. Help him. We'll bring in Jeremy Lin. <laughs> Help him get his back-to-back -back championships. And you're going to play minutes for us, my guy. Right? Nope. He's still... You know what, Catavius? I'm okay with not having him run minutes. We will give it to Jeremy Lin. All right. Um, Actually, we'll give some of that to Jeremy Lin. That may be a bit much. So we'll take some minutes from our bench players. I want my stars to be out there. Kawhi, I need a healthy season. And boom. This is our team. Championship right now. Championship of bust. Whenever we do a challenge like this, it's 100% championship of bust. If we don't get the championship, the video is regardless, and we just chalk it up as an L. But uh, I feel like this team is good enough to win a championship. Regular season just capped off with an L. We won 61 games, which is good. Which is actually great, but in comparison to what it could have been, maybe not that great. See, there are teams out there that are better than us, like the Lakers. We're going to have to face them eventually. Um, did Kawhi get any all-NBA nods? No, but Zion did. Defensive team... Yes, we do have Kawhi there, and that is it. All right, so we ended up as the one seed in the Eastern Conference, which is dope. The best team, you know, on this side of the bracket. We ended with the highest point differential in the entire league, so that is a bit promising. Um, at home, we were dope. Let me just take a look at stats. That Kawhi did not make an all-NBA team, which means that stats had to be trash, right? Well, they weren't trash. Um, he shot at all-time high. Look at that, 54%. 40%, 45% from three. These are all, you know, all-time numbers. He just didn't get as many shots because he has more options because Bradley Beal is on the team. Jamal Murray's on the team. DJ Warren. So, you know, we got this, man. First round, we're going against Boston. Somehow, Boston's only an eight seed, and that's kind of tough to go against them in the first round, or maybe not tough at all because I trust my guys. I trust my guys to go out there and get a dub, get four dubs, and they did exactly that, four dubs in a row. Second round, it looks like we're going against Milwaukee. They almost blew a 3-1. They, they was hoping we ain't see that, but we did. We're up 3-0 against them. Are we going to just mop the flow with the Eastern Conference? Oh, there's our first loss. Oh, okay, 2-2, 3-2, finals. And in the finals, we're going against the Warriors. 1-1, 2-1. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> we're down 3-1. That is a bit tough. I'll be honest with you, because you don't want to go down 3-1. But it's against the Warriors. So, anything is possible. Just please win. Don't, don't lose 4-1. There it is. It's like we're getting the dub here. We do. We win by 10. 
The Simcast just makes me feel so much better when I can watch things unfold. And we kill them in the second quarter. It looks like we stay alive to force a game seven. And since it is game seven, we're short in the rotation. Kawhi is tired. It does not matter. This is a game seven, my guy. I saw what you did in one game seven. You need to do the exact same thing. Game winning shot. Kawhi Leonard in the corner. Six bounces off the rim. And it looks like we're going to win. They blew another 3-1. Can I show y'all something I found? First of all, Kawhi Leonard wins Finals MVP. Let me show you something I just bought. It's the gold fun guy hoodie. Isn't that cool? You know, because I am also a fun guy. Shout out to New Balance for that. I mean, not that they sent it to me. I paid my own money. But I really like the sweatshirt, so I had to pick it up. Shout out to Kawhi. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave it a like. Shout out to you for getting to this point. Uh, I'll be back very soon. I don't know if it's tomorrow, the day after, the day after that. Because currently, as you're watching this video, I'm in New York. It's like some inception. As you know, YouTubers record videos in advance. And it's like they never went anywhere. I'm in New York for a whole week whole week but to you i'm at home <laughs> it's magic i'll be back peace